be fair, we've been really lucky. The season for us has been full of mainly ups. Really, I can't can't think of too many downs that we've had. Um, good start to the year, and then since then the looks just got better and better. We got our first win this year, and then we got another a race weekend here with two wins. And then when we got that, I think we had a nice gap, 27, 28 points on the championship buffer. I found it an unusual year because if you imagine. We've gone from the start of the year where it's maximum attack every race to coming into the last three weekends on maximum defense saying, well look, if Tony finishes with X points, all I need is to finish with X points. So it's been interesting like, to see how my mentality's changed through the year. All we needed was a good finish there. I think we needed really more than four points. I think Tony had a bit of an issue coming on to the last lap which opened the door for me to make a move on him, which you're always gonna take, so but that's racing, you gotta take them moments when they come to you, so it got the championship done, so yeah, I'm over the moon, so I have to win it. To be fair, look, when we started racing last year, I turned around and said to myself, oh, I think I can win it. <laughs> so I think it's just something that's in most people that race, you know, you wanna win, that's what you're there to do. This car has been super reliable, really. I, you know, you got to take a hat off to it and to the boys in Stone Motorsport because they have the car running perfect every weekend. So it makes it a bit easier for me to get in and not be under pressure or worrying, you know, is this right, is that right? You know, the lads do a great job, so can't complain.